One of the greatest challenges we face as a society is the growing cost and complexity of healthcare services. Faced with a growing crisis, governments, healthcare providers, and patients are searching for innovative solutions. In Brazil, every citizen has the right to full health care, from primary care to immunization to heart transplants, for free, any place in the country. This is the national health care system, and we are very proud of the system. The challenge is, how do you provide quality health care when you have to distribute your budget taking care of a population that is getting older and older and at the same time taking care of all primary care issues. One of the major problems in healthcare is that there is a lot of work being done twice and there is a lack of information when it's important to have it. I always wonder why this technology is not helping me to provide a better care. Why can't I have a system here telling me if I'm using a drug that has drugs interaction? The current project at Sao Paulo City Department of Health, it's very interesting because we could take the pieces and bits of former projects that were developed by the Department of Health of Brazil and join the pieces in a proper way. By doing that, we were able to deliver to the city a fully integrated system that uses Java-oriented technology. The system is a major tool to organize the distribution of resources and by doing that to provide better health care to the population. In order to be effective, the healthcare information system has got to have the information available when and where it's required. The idea of having a unique identifier is very important because that's the only way to cope with the patient mobility. So I, when I'm here today, I can be in Manaus tomorrow or view the day after tomorrow. And my, the data regarding me has got to follow me. You have an essential data set about this patient. What is his medication? What are the exams I have asked for? What are the diagnoses? And then I can treat properly. And of course, this, on, as a, a consequence, you also lower costs because you are not going to ask the same exam that had already been done. One of the criteria we have used to build an architecture system is that it has to be an open platform because we have to integrate different things. We have to communicate with different platforms, but within this, it has to be very, very simple. This kind of application has to be web-based. It's much simpler this way. G2E architecture allows us to have scalability and to deliver uh, the same application in small cities and on big cities. As Java is platform independent, no complexity here, just a simple browser, and then you have the complexity all on the server side, on an open platform. Java is great because we have lots of concerns about security because we understand that this kind of information we deal, we have to secure it, and we put a lot of effort trying to make this application as secure as possible. I think we will have better healthcare systems in Brazil because of the work we are doing now. I think Java community should be inspired in using technology for a social impact. Technology has to be used not only because it is a nice technology, technology has to be used to make life better for people.